Oh, oh, oh. All right, so I just got done talking to the manager lady here. Here is my next unit right here. We're, we're buying this week. I think I got six that I've bid on. Uh, yeah, this is, everybody says, oh, that looks like so much fun. Yeah. See what I brought first? Yeah, we're going to just put it all in there first, come back later for the goods. Um, this little curio thing here, garbage. Ugh, give me a second here. See if I can get this uh, mattress fit. All right, I'm back. Uh, so when I'm talking to the manager lady, she tells me that this is kind of the unit that they put a whole bunch of other junk in. I was like, oh, great. So there is going to be nothing in here for me. But, you know, sometimes, ooh, some bed, that looks like a nice bed frame. Oh, that, look at this. The joys of storage units. The joys of storage unit. Anyway, this is probably going to mostly go on the trailer. Um, well, that's kind of a neat old table. Beat to heck. So, uh, if I find anything good, I'll let you know. No. Videos. All those jaws. VHS tapes. My player broke, so hopefully there's one of those in here. just what I needed all right here's the goods uh, we got a mirror it looks like it went up to the uh, bolted to the back of a dresser or something um, but I think those come off so nice big mirror a little dinner table here it's kind of cute all metal I think these are going to be modified for something for better pictures in my shop this table is obviously you can tell is uh, needs refinished but the grain looks pretty good and I think it's all there think i don't know but uh, obviously needs a refinish uh cute little cute little box here washer i have to come back for that tomorrow uh, i'm gonna first i was gonna toss it but i think i'm gonna try and put together this little crib we'll see see how it goes together it's obviously not up to safety standards of the day but uh it's cutesy and that bookcase looks pretty decent and there's a couple extra shelves down there uh some scrap metal and then this big bed i think it was a king but uh i noticed that uh, i was going to save it and then i noticed there's some broken parts on it i'm gonna have to come back for that tomorrow it's going to the garbage looks like there's some home appliances in here maybe a crock pot or two this is why we do it though it's an old zenith Stereo, record player, LP player. I have no idea if it works. There's multiple signs of mice. I do have my hand sanitizer. So uh, we're going to load all this stuff up. I'm going to have to come back for probably the washer and uh, that stuff. And why am I going to have to come back? <laughs> there's a few mattresses in here and uh, I debated on whether or not to dump my trailer this morning it was full to about the top glad I did well with a little ingenuity and probably a couple visits to a chiropractor it's clean uh so this is the biz. I don't. I don't think I'm gonna make much on this one, if anything. Uh, it's gonna depend probably on how much that little uh, console player is gonna do. But I'm full up. I got the good stuff in the back. But anyway, thank you. Back of the shop. I've been working hard on this place. Got a ton of shelves up. This is gonna be. I don't know. This is shop 5.2. I don't know. Uh, I'm going to start bringing in some of this product, but uh, shelves, shelves, shelves. My idea that the product's going to come in here on the floor, fill the floor, and I should be able to put the good stuff up in here. And, of course, I still have the warehouse. Once I get the, the stuff up here I want to sell, I'll clean it, price it, test it, move it over to the warehouse. So uh, let the fun begin. Hmm. 
All right, got some Almond Brothers on here. And, uh, boy, I'm tired. Let's go over the, let's get back here. Oh, hey, hey, whoa. Let's go over what we got here. Uh, there was one bin of, well, mostly those hangers that you saw, a couple other odds and ends, nothing special. Uh, the legs for this table are here. This is nice, it splits in the middle. I do not have the leaves, but there is a lot of tracks right there. Um, I haven't opened it up, but it looks like it would come apart quite a ways. And, uh, I don't know. It could be a nice small table, and, and, and you'd probably make the leaves, or I'm thinking about keeping it. I don't know, I might make some leaves, and who cares what you paint them, because uh, they put a tablecloth over it. Uh, one block is broken right here, too. But besides that, it looks like, besides some loose screws, um, it's pretty good. This lamp's working. Looks pretty good, looks all complete. Might even use that around here if uh, nobody buys it to uh, help with my uh, pictures and stuff. This is working. Uh, I mentioned it might have been a crock pot, and it's three crock pots. Um, it's GE. My testing is not complete, really. I plug it in, make sure it gets uh, warm, and uh, unplug it. The VCR lot. There's a couple in there that I might keep around here. Or, hey, they all go for sale. I just have a couple over here that I like to watch. If I can get another VCR. Here's that big mirror. Uh, the legs will come off there pretty easy, and uh, I have parts and pieces to uh, hang it any which way you want it. I decided to save this. I think I was telling you that. Save this crib. I got a base, and um, if I can get back far enough, where's my zoom at? Oh, yeah. uh, and four sides. So I got the bottom and four sides. Uh, I, I'm going to try and see if I can find the fasteners and put it together, but it's all this nice. These are the sides. Got the top upside down. Anyway, it's about as far as I've went with that. There's the, the bottom where the mattress goes. TV tray. Little basket crate one piece is broke right there I'm gonna try and maybe put some uh, pins in it or a screw or something like that and then my favorite which I'm bummed about but the uh, little console um, as I was sitting here looking at it I'm like hey where's the power cord well it takes an adapter type deal in the back we're gonna go upside down for a second oh hold on something that plugs in on that uh, I could probably hotwire it to test it, but I'm not sure about the polarity, so uh, i got to have an expert on that. Uh, I did get a Pat Benatar record. Which one is it? Right there. We're going to toss that on maybe maybe after the Allman Brothers here. Uh, it's an old... A couple extra parts that were inside. Uh, not sure where these switches go or any of this. I'll uh, give it to the guy that's going to look at it, but... Um, if I can hotwire it, I can see if the AM, FM works and speakers and stuff. Uh, and that will give me a direction on where to go. One other problem that I noticed, maybe you saw it in the other video. There's your problem, lady. So, uh, if I can get the radio to work, then, uh, <laughs> we'll look into that. As usual, if you see anything you like, hit me up. Uh, right now is the time to get it at uh, Greed Savings before I, before I start messing with it. Dilly dilly. And a nickel. <laughs>